cardiovascular disease uh, across the country is one of the major concerns we have in the healthcare field. One in four deaths are associated with some cardiovascular comorbidity. Um, every 34 seconds, someone in the United States has a heart attack. And every one minute, a person dies from a complication of cardiovascular disease. When we think about that as a grand total, one of every four people who die in the United States have some heart disease or cardiovascular problem. On a financial basis, this is a burden of about 100 uh, to $110 billion every year. When you look at the risk factors for heart disease, there are some that carry significant weight. Uh, things like high blood pressure, abnormal cholesterol levels, um, smoking. And when you take a, a picture of citizens of the United States, about 49% of those people have at least one of those risk factors for heart disease. Uh, when we look at some of the other common risk factors for heart disease, things like diabetes and obesity and abnormal diet, uh, lack of physical activity, and as well as excessive alcohol, even more people are brought into that circle of people who have risk factors. Mississippi has some of the highest rates of cardiovascular disease across the country. The Centers for Disease Control commonly will uh, release the records. And at one time uh, in the early 2000s, uh, the whole state of Mississippi by county had some of the highest rates of cardiovascular disease in the country. And that is part of it is the high rates of tobacco abuse with almost 26% of the population as active smokers. Uh, high rates of obesity where almost 36% of the population is overweight. Uh, combined with the fact that there is uncontrolled diabetes in areas and uh, strong family histories of coronary artery disease. The other issue with regard to citizens of Mississippi and heart disease is the fact that there are 19 cardiovascular centers which can deal with patients who are having acute myocardial infarctions or heart attacks. Um, and there is some great distance between some of these centers, leaving people in less populated counties in Mississippi uh, to have to travel great distances for their health care. Potentially dangerous heart disease has many uh, symptoms which are, are key to recognizing early in order to uh, obtain medical care promptly to help eliminate some of the long-term risks that are associated with the cardiovascular disease. Things like chest discomfort, uh, arm or jaw pain, nausea, shortness of breath, especially that come on suddenly, are all major warning signs of cardiovascular disease. And unfortunately, in a poll done in the state of Mississippi, only 92% of people could identify one major uh, symptom of cardiovascular disease in an acute myocardial infarction. Some of the things that we can do on a daily basis to help protect us from heart disease are one, being very diligent about watching our blood pressure uh, with daily monitoring and communicating with our physician some of our daily blood pressures so that it can be adequately controlled. Discontinuing things like tobacco abuse, whether that's smoking or even chewing tobacco, uh, as well as being involved in a daily exercise uh, program with just 20 to 30 minutes of aerobic activity four to five times a week being adequate. Also eating a regular diet and, and low in saturated fats and having our cholesterol monitored on a regular basis in order to decrease our risk factors for cardiovascular disease.